I met a gin so barroom queen in Memphis. She tried to take me upstairs for a ride. What's up, guys? Kevin here from Relax Learn Guitar. We are checking out the Rolling Stones, Honky Tonk Women. Great little tune. Uh, perfect if this is uh, one of the first kind of Stones tune, Rolling Stones song you're taking on. This is the kind of strummer, kind of beginner version of this song. Uh, Relax Learn Guitar. I believe you're never too old to learn. And I help music lovers over 40 become the guitar players they've always wanted to be. And this is a great choice to kind of start down that path. So let's get started. All right, let's break down these chords. Some open, easy chords for beginners here. We've got a G chord. Now for that G chord, you can play that with the kind of three finger, more traditional. I like playing the G chord a lot with a four finger G, where I'm adding in my ring finger to the second string third fret, and then using my pinky on that first string third fret. And that's kind of the four finger G, a little more fuller. We've also got a C chord. For the C chord, remember not to play the sixth string. It's a fifth string root on this chord, so fifth string down. And be sure you arch those fingers and get those pressed into that fretboard so you have nice clear ringing out there. Then we have an A7. Great sounding little chord there. Now for that, I always like to imagine, here's your A chord. An A7 chord, you're just not playing that, uh, you're leaving that third string open. It's better to fret it this way, the middle finger on that fourth string second fret, and that ring finger on the second string second fret. And then we also have a D chord. And for that D chord, it's important to remember, you're gonna strum mostly those high strings, strings four through one, the thinnest strings there on your guitar. To learn the first eight chords that you should know as a beginner, check out the link in the description below where I go over those chords that include many of the ones that are used in this song. Now, when I was first starting out, I really listened to a lot of Stone songs and thought, I will never be able to play like that. But this song, you can definitely start here with the strumming version and sound really good doing it. So for this intro, we got a really cool little drum fill at the beginning with some cool little drum, uh, cowbell in there, I think. And then you want to fret that G chord. I'm using that four finger version. And if you listen, there's a guitar part that goes. Now, you're only gonna play the middle strings in this G chord, not the high strings and the low strings, mostly strings four and three there. For that intro piece, just to kind of get things started. If you like this lesson so far, be sure and hit that like button. It'll really help us out. Then we're gonna go into a strum pattern here. On that G chord is where it starts. So grab your guitar, mute the strings actually. Just lay your fingers over the strings so you get this sound. And we're going with a uh, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. You can use this strum pattern for the entire song. Starts on a G. I met a gin soap barroom queen in Memphis to a C. Back to G. She tried to take me A7 for a D. Now in terms of the number of strums or the number of strum patterns these chords get, the G gets two strum patterns. C gets two. Back to that G for one. A seven for one. So those kind of split those there. To the D for two. Repeat. She G to heave me right across her C. Cause I G can't seem to D her off my G. So same kind of idea there. The uh, G gets two strum patterns right across the shoulder. C for two strum patterns. 
back to G for one, because I just can't seem to. Then he goes to the D for the drink her off my mind. D gets one pattern. Drink her off my back to G for two. And there you have the verses for the song. Then it's time for that chorus. It's the get your honky tonks out. It's the honky tonk women. Give me, give me, give me the honky tonk blues. Same strum pattern. Starts on the G. It's the hon to a D. Honky tonk back to G. Women. So there it's one strum pattern, G. One strum pattern, a D. Two strum patterns, a G. And then the give me is a G. Give me, give me D. The honky tonk G's. And then you have the chorus as well. Now inside my Relax on Guitar membership, the lesson there includes those embellishments I kind of had at the beginning of this lesson when you, uh, for the intro. And then also the, uh, so if you'd like to learn more about that membership option, check out the link in the description. So have fun with that one, add that to your set list. And like I said, if you'd like to learn the eight most important chords to learn when you're first starting out on the guitar, definitely check out this lesson where I show you exactly how to do that. Remember, you're never too old to learn, and I'll see you guys for the next lesson. Come on.